Well guys, uh, as you probably been part of this GameStop uh, saga, you know who is Roaring Kitty, you know who is DF Value, the person who made millions of dollars on GameStop. Unfortunately, I just found an article which stated that the Roaring Kitty actually has been sued for the security fraud over GameStop rise. Wow, this is unbelievable. Kate Gill, one of the most influential voices that pushed GameStop on the Wall Street Bets forum was hit with a lawsuit that accused him of misrepresenting himself as an amateur investor and profiting by artificially inflating the price of the stock. I think the person lost like 25 million dollars, but why? Why they're suing him for? The proposed class action against Gio, who adopted online nickname Roaring Kitty, was filed Tuesday in court, court of Massachusetts. Okay, what, what the suit says? The suit said Jill was actually a licensed security professional who manipulated the market to profit himself. So what if you have a couple of license to be a financial professional, you cannot give advices online on YouTube, uh, Twitter and other social media networks? Well, that's, that's the first time I heard something about this. The lawsuit said Jill, who has been written about extensively by Bloomberg, the New York Times, the Wall Street Journal and others, was far from being an amateur stock picker. Rather, he is a chartered financial analyst who holds multiple broker licenses and was previously employed by Massachusetts Mutual Life Insurance. Well, I guess here comes uh, maybe first major issue if you work for some of these financial institutions, if you have access to some kind of data that's not available for public. And yeah, if you use this data, to trade, to take advantage from the stock market uh, and publicly announce this data that shouldn't be uh, shared publicly. Maybe this is one of the reasons why he's been a uh, foul suit against him. But uh, see how they actually uh, create a picture, a profile for him. They said, in order to motivate amateur traders, Jill fashioned himself as a kind of a Robin Hood and characterized security professional as villains. The lawsuit said Jill, however, it's not amateur. For many years, he actively worked as a professional in the investment and financial industries. Well, I definitely feel bad for the guy. The guy look very real. I don't know, uh, probably, yeah, there is some uh, problem of uh, sharing this information. Of course, we, we don't know all the details. We don't know all the laws. We're not into financial industry. As we all know, we are all amateur investors. We're here just to share our experience and uh, find different ways of uh, making investments, right? Learn different ways to invest, finding another company that is undervalued in the market and put more money and uh, appreciate uh, its value to the place where we expect it to be. Yeah, I definitely feel bad about the guy.